Hello everyone, welcome back to channel. Today in front of you Epson 690 dot matrix printer LQ690. Today I am going to teach you uh, about the settings of this printer. Uh, without computer, there are some settings of this printer because this is a dot matrix printer. So there are many settings inside the main board or formatter board like tractor settings, sizes or font size or tier off, tier on like these settings. Uh, here I have two papers. This is the current setting of this uh, printer. That is totally wrong. Uh, what's there? What's the, what is there in the settings? First of all, page length for tractor, skip power, pro, perforation, auto tear off, and print direction, auto line feed, and these are settings. Okay, and also language here. In the other side, it's written. Uh, okay, pitch or like this buzzer manual feed wait time so how to access the setting mode and how to make the correct settings today just i'm going to teach you you have to feed the paper if your printer is in ready state there is no error in the printer just feed the paper behind and press these two but two buttons simultaneously and okay it's appeared in front of you the first of all language and this option written here yes colon set slash no and item move down current language is english because there is a un uh, underline english if if any language from these underline it means that the default language of this printer for settings is uh, the same language that is underlined in this printer it's english but if i want to change uh, uh, not english other than other language i will press arrow button down arrow button it will move behind and now arrow is on French. Again, I will move move down. The arrow is on Dutch language. Again, I will press the arrow button. Now the underline is on Italian. So this this arrow button is moving uh, down. It's, it's continuously changing the language. Again, I will press because I have, we have to move Spanish now and now Portuguese. Then again English. This is now on Portuguese. And now on English it's K so we have uh, now English language is English I will press set button to confirm the setting okay now it's asking me uh, you want to print the current settings if I will press yes button it will print for me like this page and it will show us that what is the current settings of this printer let's we print the current setting of the printer I will say yes to set button it will print for us the current settings of this printer i already fixed the settings but we will make sure the current settings of this machine okay it need one more page uh, so we will add another page to complete okay here you go this is the current settings of this printer and and uh, this these settings are uh, quite fine no issue with these settings uh, page length for character should be 12 inch skip power profession should be off auto tear off you can make according to your requirement off or on these are the exact settings and this is a correct setting for a new printer of epson lq690 okay for the sake of argument if i want to change anything in between that so how can we change like it's showing the first option page length for tractor page length for tractor if it's uh, damaged or it's, it's changed by mistake or anyway how can we bring to 12 inch again i will if we will move the arrow button down it will go uh, another option second option is skip power perforation uh, perforation perforation okay if i will move down it will move uh, for second option but if i want to change this 12 inch i have to press the set button but i will show you first if i will press arrow button it's moved to skip our perforation okay perforation okay it's off now and also here it's off uh, the correct settings is perforation is off so if you we want to change this 12 inch tractor size setting we have to move back plus uh, upper arrow button it will go again to 12 inch if i want to set rather than 12 inch uh, if i want to set 
another number like uh, 14 inch or 17 inch so I will press the set button now it's showing me that 14 inch in the front again I will press set button it's showing me 17 inch if I will move down it will stick to the 17 inch but we have to bring it to 12 inch okay and the correct setting is 12 inch so I have to move uh, again set button I have to press to bring the 12 inch option I will press continuously set button it will appear till it will appear 12 inch we have to set it to 12 inch I am pressing set button okay it's ch changing continuously now 4 inch the 5.5 now six, seven, eight, seven, eight, eight point five, seventeen over seventy over six, eleven inch, then seventy over six. Now the option will appear twelve inch. Okay, it's not twelve inch. So if this is a default position for this printer, twelve inch. Now I will similarly I will move down with the arrow button. Now it's showing the skip power proportion, another option. So uh, you have to uh, make the correct setting. If you want to change, you can use uh, press the set button to change the value, set the value actually. And like this, I will move arrow button, press the arrow button, it will move down, auto tear off. If I want to change uh, auto line feed off or on, how I can change now, it's off now. If I will press set button, it's now on but we have to keep it off I will press again set button okay it's off I have this uh, new printers uh, page uh, that is uh, correct settings I will attach also hopefully in the description or these correct settings you have to set according to this page okay and now all if it's finish all setting you have to press these two buttons together to save the setting if you don't want to save the setting just turn off the printer it will raise all settings but I will press this two button to save settings you hear the beep now settings has been saved I will press this button to eject the paper and I will turn off and will turn back on again and the all settings has been saved in the formatter board so this was the method if you want to change your printer settings like this type of setting you can do with this method if you have any other question you can ask down in the comments thank you for watching all the best and subscribe